Good morning, friends. Mark Holmes here, and as always, thank you guys for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, this literally, and I mean literally, doesn't work. It's game day. It's game day battle of survival here. One team will get a victory and have some hope and some bragging rights. The other one is truly in full rebuild mode. As you can see, it's raining out. It's gotten kind of chilly, and it's going to be a bit of a sloppy day. I'm sure the field's been covered in Washington, and uh, it's going to be a mess. <sighs> I've been up and down all day long or all night long uh, working on the barbecue. i, I got to get some more coal in here. Charcoal, bear with me here. It's game day morning, and <clears throat> we've got some people coming over. So that way we can hopefully enjoy watching our Dallas Cowboys, hopefully get a victory. And if nothing else, we're going to eat good. I haven't checked on her since four o'clock this morning. All right, let, let's see what we got here. <clears throat> We're up to 172 degrees. Let, let me give you a peek. That's how you're supposed to have your hog. That, that's how you're supposed to have your hog. Let's check on the fire here. Yeah, she's lacking a little bit. But what I put in here for... Yeah, it's definitely needs some more wood. Whew, still got a little puff of smoke. So, this season is not the season that we wanted. This is the season not that we expected. This season, quite frankly, sucks. It sucks what we got right now, but it is what it is. You know, some people are saying, yeah, you're going to watch a garbage-ass team. Yeah, we're watching second and third string players, guys that are journeymen, people who we never thought that we were going to be cheering for, some people you never even heard of before. But I hope that all these guys who are here understand the history that was before them. The Dallas Cowboys and the Washington football team, this is the first, I guess this is the first one of the new rivalry. Cowboys versus the Washington football team. The Cowboys lead the series 73-43, I think it is, and two. They met twice in the playoffs, both times the Cowboys lost to... George Allen and uh, Joe Gibbs. Cowboys have had more success in their shorter tenure in the NFL. We've had strange games from just strange games. Let's just call it crazy games, crazy endings. And it's never mattered who was the best team that won. Doesn't matter. Right now, you look at both of these teams, and it's, uh, it, it, I'll be honest, it's a disgrace. It sucks to think that both of these teams, that between them, have won eight Super Bowls, that right now we have three wins between the two of us. But today, if you get a victory, you get a victory today. It will give both, either one, the biggest boost that you've seen. I'll be honest with you. Right now, it just feels like it's been forever since we got a win. Forever. I just want to just just I, I want to smoke a cigar tonight. I want to actually sit down and have a victory cigar, have a drink, and just relax, knowing that my team finally got a victory. This season isn't going to end the way we want to. You know, we, we've learned some things, and hopefully we'll learn some things about some other guys 
on this team that will be beneficial to the future. Because, quite frankly, after what we've seen on the field this year, there's not a lot of fire on some of these guys. <clears throat> and as good as we thought we were going to be, the reality is, is we may not have as much talent as we think. And that we need a whole new cast of characters to really get back where we used to be. Now, I ain't gonna sugarcoat it. I'm not going to bullshit you. I'm not going to bullshit you. I don't know that we can get a win today. We literally are the worst team that I have ever seen the Dallas Cowboys field. I'm sorry, guys. I, I, I hate to say that to my Dallas Cowboys. With all the injuries, with the change in coaching, this is the worst Dallas Cowboy team that I've ever seen, that I can ever remember. You know, at least the 1-15 in 15 team you knew was rebuilding and starting all over. I don't know, maybe that's the point where, where we really are now. We've been kidding ourselves saying that we're not rebuilding. And maybe that's what we actually are doing. But we got a long ways to go. At least a win today would help get us a little bit closer to where we want to be. Yeah. It's a cold, wet October. Maybe we can make some history here. Maybe we can turn the season around. Maybe we can give our fans... Squirrel coming up the steps. Maybe we can give our fans a little bit of hope. Me? You can see. I've been up all night long. And I'm ready to smoke some hogs. I hope them Dallas Cowboy players, when they step out of that field, that toxic waste dump that is FedEx Field, that place that I have been there the last five years watching the Dallas Cowboys win four of the last five games there. I hope that those guys get up off the mat, show some character, stop pointing fingers at everybody else, and find a way to get a victory. I don't know about you guys. I'm tired of standing out in the rain and the cold. We'll be live 1 o'clock. Be there. I'll see you.